Good morning, everybody. It's the Savage Stacker. So, there's a lot of new people getting into gold and silver lately uh, because of the Reddit thing and the silver short squeeze. And uh, and a lot of people that got, got made profits off of uh, GameStop putting their money into gold and silver. And the premiums are ridiculous. So, I'm done buying silver for a minute. And... Uh, I'm jumping back into gold. Now, I'm not a silver stacker at all. I am a, I am a everything, all metal stacker. I need to get a little bit better in my platinum position, but um, I've definitely, definitely got about 50-50 silver to gold ratio. Maybe, probably 60-40. I'm probably 40 to the gold, 60 to the silver, and um, I was at 50-50 for a while. Now, um, that's as far as my stack ratio. There was a good opportunity the other day to, uh, you know, trade some silver for gold. I did not jump on that. I really wish I would have. Um, but my LCS, you know, things were kind of crazy with him. He didn't know where he was at, what he was going to do. And he said the line was out the door. He couldn't keep silver in stock. There were a few, a couple people selling Uh and they said exactly what's happening now. They're like, it's not going to last. It's going to go. And uh, I'm going to take my $29 an ounce and uh, get out of this and probably go buy some gold. And that's what they were saying. Well, the other people were buying up anything and everything he had in stock. And he couldn't keep anything in stock. The premiums right now on silver are ridiculous. I, my suggestion would be to maybe hold out for a little bit. Maybe they'll come down, but you know, the amount of silver that's out there right now, uh, it ain't much, it ain't much. People are selling out quick at these high premiums. Um, I was able to get me a nice tube of Eagles before the price of the, uh, uh, went up, and that was on Friday, and I wish I would have bought five tubes, and I could have, but I didn't. Um, I wanted to keep some cash around just in, just in case. And then my latest on my gold purchases are these two 10th ounce um, eagles here. And I got these, I picked these up in Rio on uh, January 13th. And on my way back home, I bought that and uh, these bars, these three bars here. And I got them all for a great price. You know, these bars were, you know, I think two, 250, two, 222, something like that. But I picked these up, these 10th these ounce for 200 bucks a pop. Just over, just over 200 bucks. Um, and what a good deal. You, you can't beat the power of a, of a good LCS, a good local coin shop. So a little information out there. This is a long-term hold. This isn't a buy and flip real quick thing. There are people that can do it. I don't. But silver is a very, very, very volatile market. And you got to be very careful on how you invest in it. You know, if you buy silver today at $42, $40, $38, some places an ounce, and you're gonna be waiting maybe a long time for it to, to, to break even or go above that. I think this year we may go up. There's a lot of stuff going on, but I'm watching all this weird stuff happen with the dollar. The dollar hasn't been above 90 um, in, all, all, all this all this year and half of last year and now all of a sudden all this reddit stuff happened the silver squeeze short squeeze and now it's at 91.4 and going up teetering up and down and uh that that tells me right there that you know there's a lot of people selling stocks getting cash putting their faith in the cash so they can buy metals and um it also tells me that that they're manipulating the crap out of the market me right now I put my faith in gold just because it's less volatile and the premiums aren't as bad. Is silver a bad investment or is it a bad hedge? No, I would say not, but I would say right now because of the premiums, I would hold back a little bit. Um, make these companies come down on their prices, you know. They're 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 getting they're getting silver for a higher price right now as well. So that translates into us paying a larger um, premium. And, uh, you know, they think it's going to go up. And uh, they got a hedge. They got a hedge for a couple months out. And 
they can't buy stuff for a really high price and not make the premiums back on that because what if it does go up next month they're losing money so you know they're going to keep them premiums high for probably for a few months if not longer and um, there's a lot of new people out there remember this is a long-term hold it's a hedge against inflation it's a savings account it's not a quick flip it's not it's not an investment this is something you hold on to for years most of the time um I've done really well buying gold and silver, being able to save. It's a savings account for me. I'm not really looking to get uh, for to, to invest in it and, and it, uh, make a ton of profit, even though I have made some profits in the last, you know, couple years. But it could it could go it, that could all go away really quick. I mean, we're last I checked a couple minutes ago, we were at uh, uh, 1811 for gold. I mean. We haven't been at 1811 in, in a few months, so things are getting weird. It could go down. It could be volatile. Uh, at any moment, it could just drop on us. So just be careful what you're doing. I like gold right now. I'm going to probably go try to pick some more up um, before that gets crazy. And uh, hopefully the premiums come down on everything else. All right, you guys. Thank you guys for coming by. What are you stacking on? What is your opinions? What do you think is going to happen? Um, I think the silver short squeeze is pretty much over, but you never know. Things could get crazy. People need silver really bad for everything. Cars, for solar, for phones, for so much stuff. The medical field, we, we, we need silver. So if we all own it and there ain't much out there, you know, it, it could go it could go crazy. But I like gold. I really like gold. God, I really like gold. Gold is great. All right, thank you guys for coming by. I appreciate it. It's a Savage Stacker. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Savage Stacker's over and out. Pick yourself up some of this stuff right here. Look at that. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look at those. I like these maples. All right, thank you. Later.